welcome back to me and Monami on this very early Sunday morning. And today we're going to attempt a, a very special challenge because today here in the south of France is Super Sunday when there are absolutely countless car boot sales across the whole region. And we are going to attempt to visit as many of them as we can in our car without a boot. So our challenge begins today here in Villefranche with the, uh, the car boot sale at the end of Villefranche Beach. We're then gonna go into Monaco. So we're gonna leave France and try and find out what it's like at a car boot sale in one of the richest countries on earth. We're then gonna come back into France, drive right down the coastline to Cancer and then finally, we're hoping, if we can make it in time, to reach the car boot sale of villeneuve loubet So uh, it should be quite a spectacular drive and you should get a very good flavor of what these wonderful brocantes, or vide greniers as the French call them, are really like. Oh, it's kicking off here. There's a fight, there's a fight. The tip, if you're coming to Villefranche, this is a very good place to park because there's quite a lot of parking along this road and it's free. Me insane. Flowers and chocolate in the color that matches my bonnet. Oh, no, it's not. Toilet seat. Oh, lovely. Look at me, I'm a YouTuber. I quite like this old uh, calendar here, Mr. Boo. When they begin. What about this for you? It's gorgeous. It'll fit in the car better than the other one, and it'll add to our old people's home feel. Miss Havisham's wedding gown up there, look. These are gorgeous, all these board games. Look at the boxes. Oh, yeah, when, when we were all in Europe. Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a board game called Electric Lottery. Timely. Boo's making the first purchase of the day, Electric Lottery. I'm not quite sure what he's going to do with it, but he wants it. Oui, j'ai vu. Thank you, Timothy. Parfait. Merci bien. Bon dimanche. Mr. Boo spotted something else he likes. It's this Cinzano bag. Gorgeous. A combien? 12 euro. I think that's a buy. I think we need that. What do you think of this, Halloween? Look, what's this? Oh, look, it's a house for Halloween. We could take her on holiday in it. Car stand here, look. Monte Carlo rally. Some old lights. Playboy playing cards. Any Johnny Halliday? I'm not seeing any Johnny. There's usually some Johnny. Oh, best of Pavarotti. Look at that hair. Cracking. I wouldn't say that was the best Villefranche Bracante I've ever been to, would you? No. Reed Grenier, but you did get, I think, two uh, great bargains. And also, I think they're lovely. In fact, I thought all those board games were lovely. If we had a bigger house, we could have got them all. Do you think it'll work, the electric one? I hope so. We'll give it a whirl later. Anyway, it's now time to move on to the second of our Vid Greniers, and we are headed to the Socialist People's Republic of Monaco. Wow, 
quite a uh, queue for petrol, Mr. Boo. You might realise, folks, that there is a, a bit of a crisis on here in France. Not because there's a shortage of petrol, but I think there's a strike with delivery drivers or something. But basically, 50% of uh, petrol stations are fuelless, and the minute word gets round that there's some fuel, well, queues develop. Again, Monaco has been dug up and we've been redirected into Fontvieille. Oh la la, is there ever a time you come to Monaco when they haven't changed completely the traffic system? It has been under development what feels like my entire lifetime because they're running out of space and they just keep building and building and building into the sea, into the ground, up into the sky up the junta. Ah, the glamour of Fontvieille. This is actually still Monaco, but um, it's, uh, it's down by the old football stadium and where the car museum is, interestingly. There's a very good car museum which contains most of Prince Albert of Monaco's car collection, which is apparently quite extensive. Quite well, awesome. So, after that slight deviation, we're headed towards the old town of Monaco, where the, uh, uh, Monte Carlo, where the, uh, the royal palace is, where Albert and Charlene live, apparently. Um, and where we think the car boot sale is. Do you think maybe Albert and Charlene will be getting rid of a few of their old knickknacks? Yeah, just a few, <laughs> a few bits of, like, crowns and that. feeling this car boot sale doesn't exist. God, it does. So, what do Monogasques sell on their car boot sales? Nice, that. From Valarus? Is it like Valarus? Yeah. I like that. I wonder how much it is. Look, Mr. Bull, there's Princess Grace's old spinning wheel. a dream who needs, needs ambition, ambition. Oh. are we mr boo where is this car boot sale we're right between the cathedral and the the courts or the palais de justice wow so is this the cathedral where grace kelly married rainier it certainly is Fancy doing the uh, cathedral tour, Mr. Boo? It's not much of a queue. Well, Mr. Boo, no purchases. No, and I didn't find Charlene's stall. No, maybe she's having one of her off days. So we've stopped in Cap Dye for a sandwich and a charge. We were very worried there was a Tesla in this place, but the Tesla got boosted fast. So we're getting a boost before we head on to Cancer Mare. What an absolutely glorious dog on that roof, Mr. Boo. Delightful. We should get similar. It's the sort of art that you can only see on the French Riviera. <laughs> Matisse must be turning in his... Uh, uh, self painted cut out coffin. The moon is bright, let's have some fun. I thought there were petrol in there, this couple up ahead. Do you think they're on the search for petrol, Mr. Yeah. Boo? I do. Definitely. So everybody's on the search for fuel apart from us. Not that we smug. No. Because we spend most of our life looking for chargers. Look, Mr. Bull, the mist is coming in. Call 
It's there again, our enemy. That bloody van, that camper van, going at five kilometres an hour, is going to stalk us all the way to Cancer Mare. And they say Citroen and me's called hold-ups. So we're at the lights and we're next to it. Can we overtake him? We're away, we're away, we're away, yes! We're ahead of the camper van. Look, Mr. Boo, is that a pop-up V Grenier? Oh, no. Oh, no, it's the Antique Bus Festival. Do you remember that, that yeah. year? We got, to, we got to ride on an antique bus. Very exciting. And vintage cars. In front of a, a small super yacht. 2 a.m. in the car playing our favourite song. When I take my afternoon promenade, quite a fashion card on the promenade. That's from my days when I was in the music hall with Max Miller. Cheeky chappy. Do you remember? Turn of the century. I don't remember, funnily enough. Do I do? I began my career with Max Miller. May Miller. I ended my career with Max Miller. May Miller. May Miller was a. An artiste in Glasgow we used to uh, go to in a Sunday afternoon, didn't we? In a, in a rather dodgy gay bar. She was a cracker, was May Miller. And her husband, what was he called? Robert. Robert and May Miller. They were the sort of crankies of the gay world. <laughs> I don't believe this, Mr. Boo. Look at what is up ahead. That camper van, how did he get in front of us? We overtook it at the port. He must have taken some kind of shortcut. What, for camper vans? It's not possible. It's a one-way... <laughs> it's the same van. This is surreal, folks. What did you do on Sunday? We, we just drove up and down behind a white camper van. So we are approaching Nice Airport and we are still behind the camper van. <laughs> so we're coming into Cancer Mare. Where is the... Where's the uh, B Grenier, Mr. Boo? It's in a car park. In a car park? Funny that. Uh, around the corner from the Hippodrome. From the horse racing track. Yes. Where they do trotting, like that, trotting races. It's quite a good night out, actually, if you ever come down here and you can go to a trotting meeting. It's not that expensive, is it? And you can, uh, and you can get a, a table and have your dinner and lose all your money watching trotting. That's what we did. But I think I got the trots. Do you remember that night? I must have blocked it out of my mind. It's true. I think it was something I ate. Halloween's getting a bit warm. More tired of the standard of the jokes. I'm sure we can. Good girl. We'll be coming out soon at the Hippodrome. We're nearly there. Yeah, it'll be a bit cooler. Yeah. With you right next to me. So alive and tonight. Are you liking Mr. Boo's T-shirt? He's kept very quiet about it. Well, Halloween may be obscuring it, but uh, what do you think? It's one of our uh, one of our prototypes. Is this the sort of thing you might wish to uh, to purchase? Drop us a comment in the comment section if if you like it, or if you don't like it, because uh, we don't want to order a lot of T-shirts and find nobody wants one. Well, look, here it is. Oh, here it is. So it must be oh, the it's, next it's, right. it's enormous, Mr. Boo. Oh, well, at least a car park. I know that is quite big. That is a giant. That is a giant. Is it in here? Uh, oh, yeah, you can. With you right next to me. 
So we've arrived. Let's go and check out car boot number three. I brought a bag with me just in case need anything need to buy anything. Oh, that's a nice bag. Jackie Collins novel down there, look. Lady Boss. Lady Boss. I bet that's steamy, Mr. Boo, don't you? But it's very steamy. You're thinking of making a horror movie, Mr. Boo? Mm. Something for Halloween? The Renault here, look. That's lovely. Yellow Ferrari. Beetles. Is there any Amis, any vintage Amis? Is that, that's nearly, but that's a Renault, isn't it? We love this stuff. Mmm. Valarus, probably. It's even labelled Valarus, Valaris, isn't it? Yeah. Valaris. Valeris, we've got some Valeris. We got it really cheap, didn't we? Remember, we found one for about five euros or something. A pot that was like worth, yeah, it was worth about a hundred when we looked on, on Tinterweb. Oh, we're liking this one. This is a, there's a real variety of stuff. There's sort of absolute junk through to little classics, and uh, and it's all mixed together. Look at this strange bike here. Is there any Johnny? <laughs> well, I just thought. There must be some Johnny. Scylla? Oh, it's classical. It's very... Oh, Johnny. I knew there'd be a Johnny. Oh, was it Johnny Halliday? No, it's a terracotta Barack Obama. Oh, yeah, I've always wanted one of them. Was he part of the terracotta army? Oh, it's never seen him. He looks Egyptian. Yes, we can make a terracotta Barack Obama. A little sweet corn jug. Mm. I thought it was a pineapple, but it's, it's corn. Nice. How much? Don't know. Bonjour. C'est combien? Et et baraque? Trois. Want baraque? Yeah, three. Yeah. Do you want the, the thing? I think it's nice. Let's open it again. Yeah. How much? Three. Hmm, it's lovely. Okay, on prend les deux là. Who proving just how handy a me and mon ami bag is when you're out shopping on a on a vide grenier. I love my terracotta Obama. It's going to go to a very special home. I know someone who's going to love that. A friend of the channel, in fact. Well, we're back at the car and we, it's now 10 past three and it's about 25 degrees now. It's really got quite warm, but we're going to try and make it to Villeneuve Lube to the fourth car boot sale across two countries that we've uh, done today. Hopefully, going to make it to Villeneuve Lube in time for the fourth uh, Vide Grenier, which isn't this on a roof? It's on a roof of a supermarché. At a supermarket roof. Don't say we don't treat you to uh, delights on a Sunday evening. Let's see how it goes. Here, I can't remember how to get into it. Oh, I'm going to say 
right where this blue car is. Into where this, so it's on yeah. the roof up there. It doesn't yeah. look right, there's much up there. That's where it is. Make it. it wouldn't make it up, but is it going to exist? It's straight up there. Yeah. yeah. You, you think? Yeah. It's very steep, Mr. Boo. It would have to be a car challenge right at the end, wouldn't it? Oh la la. It wouldn't be the end one of me, but it wasn't. Oh my oh. goodness. We never got. Ah. Oh, we stopped. We're going at five, as slow as we've ever gone. This is so steep. Oh. Phew. Okay. So it can't be up that one. It's there, I can see it. I can see it. That's surreal. The place is the French put a vide grenier on a Sunday in October. It's anybody's business, isn't it, where they put them? Here um, we are on the roof of the Géant Supermarché in Villeneuve, Blue Bay. And we've, it's, it, it's a full drive-in, this one. That was nearly a drive-in to Merci. But yes, I've never been to a drive-in one, of you? <laughs> they should do a drive-in cinema up here, it'd be, it'd be top. We'll have to get out, we just drive through all the stores. <laughs> Maybe. Well, he's got a hedge trimmer. That man's got a hedge trimmer, look in a box. Oh, what about this one in the shade? Uh, yeah, is this near enough? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's go and look at our fourth and final lead grenier of the day. It's 3.38. We've been up since ooh, half past six. Oh, it's kicking off here. There's a fight, there's a fight. Oh, 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 I didn't expect this. Got a feeling it's been a long day on this particular uh, V Grenier. It's kicking off. I think that's just in one family, and they do seem to be packing up. But let's see what we can uh, see. What we can see. Well, was that? Oh, look, Mr. Boo, there's a globe. I want a globe. Let's look at this. Oh, do you think it's got um, drinks inside it? I hope so. This lady beat us to it, the globe. That would have been a really good buy. Five euros in illuminated globe. We were just beaten to it and he's been here all day. If hadn't been for that fight, we'd have got it, Mr. Boo. Here's me driving, Mr. Boo. Yeah. Well, I think we've definitely arrived here just a little bit too late, but uh, kind of inevitable if we were trying to do four in a day. Halloween's exhausted. Well, that was Villeneuve Louvre, and that was Super Sunday. If you've enjoyed this video, please give us a like, please give us a thumbs up, please think about buying us a coffee. Have a great week, everyone. Stay charged. We'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.